So here's a quick uh, preview of project I'm <clears throat> working on, and this is intended to be um, kind of like an ultimate cybersecurity uh, pen, pen testing, red teaming, ultimate tool. So it's based off of the ESP32 Room 32E. And I'm trying to see how much I can get <clears throat> out of this uh, one tiny microcontroller. So let's go through everything that's on it. So first we have a NeoPixel and uh, this will help with the status. Then we have uh, four tactile buttons and these will allow to scroll through the menu of this uh, small 0.96 inch screen. It's a SSD 1306 screen. And um, I made a custom UI for it. <clears throat> then we have this uh, RC522 RFID reader. And I'm going to, I'm trying to upgrade it to the PN532, which is a lot better. Um, but I only have this one working at the moment. But uh, <clears throat> it still can copy and uh, emulate uh, basic MyFair classic cards. And then we have this uh, tiny GPS, and this will be good for the Wi-Fi scans, because then you can also add <clears throat> GPS location uh, to that as well, and you can upload it to wiggle.net or whatever. And then we have um, the IR uh, cloner, so we have the IR transmitter <clears throat> and receiver. So you can uh, really just mess with anything that has IR um, lights. And right here we have this micro SD card. And this would be good for storing all the data. <clears throat> and then the last things I'm uh, messing around with, I'm trying to get RF into there. And right now I have these basic um, RF receivers, but I also have the C1101 <clears throat> and the uh, N24RF uh, transmitter receivers, but I can't really get them uh, working at the moment. And these are like a dollar <clears throat> a piece, and they, sh they should work. So hopefully there can be some more um, RF scanning and possibly RF jamming. I do have a, a workaround where I can use um, the C1101 with the Arduino Pro, Pro Micro and have a uh, RF jammer, but I really haven't been able to get it working with the ESP32 at, at the moment. Um, but for now, there should be quite a lot of features um, because this is an ESP32, uh, there's a lot of Wi-Fi uh, features, and um, especially with Bluetooth, there's um, Bluetooth scanning, Bluetooth HID, so you can control devices. I really do just about uh, everything. And this is all going to be um, open source, and I'm going to be making a custom case and stuff for it if anyone want to buy the full uh, product. But that's what we got so far, and um, next I'll be going through uh, the UI I'm making for this. So um, you can get through all the functions uh, super easily.